Hey guys, what is up? It's Pizza Prestige and welcome back to a new video. And this video is actually going to be about a coaster that I built a pretty long time ago. I'm not sure if you guys have actually seen it. You can check it out on my channel. It's somewhere in my uploads. It's not that far um, back. But basically what it was, it was a Pantherophis, the coaster. And the coaster, um, <laughs> it's a kind of a mini hyper coaster. Um, so you can kind of compare it to Shambhala, only then a around half the size of that. So um, it's a little hyper coaster, and I built it first in Roller Coaster Tycoon World a long time ago, back when I thought it would still have some potential. <laughs> and um, I decided, you know, when I got into Planet Coaster, I decided to just let's let's just do it and let's make it in Planet Coaster. And I made a video of it, and the coaster was incredibly. Well, incredibly not smooth. How do you say that? It was pretty bad. Let's just let's just keep it up pretty bad. And it was the first coaster that I really made in uh, in Planet Coaster, and so I had to get used to the controls and stuff. Uh, but you know, now that I know more about Planet Coaster and I know how to work the game a little more, I decided, you know what? Let's just do it again. Let's just make a new coaster. Let's build it again. Let's make it a little bit bigger and some, uh, you know, some more smoother turns. To you know. It, the layout will get bigger if you do that so I decided you know let's just do that and um, right here I actually got into a little bit of a problem as you can see the I think it's called the figure eight turn um, or the figure eight loop or the awesome turn or the well whatever you want to call it some people call it the ampersand because it looks like an ampersand sig um, signature thing uh, but <laughs> anyhow um, yeah, I had to make that myself, and it was pretty pretty difficult to get that smooth. You know, the uh, the original part in the game is like a minimum of 45 meters tall, which is okay, you know, for the standard big hypers like Shambhala or whatever. But if you want to make one yourself, you're just gonna have to, you know, keep on trying and make it better. And what I learned from this is if you just use very small pieces of track, that you can actually make a very uh, smooth thing in the end. It will have lots of supports, but you can just take some of those supports away by clicking on one of the short pieces of track and just saying you know the um, coaster or track support and you can just uncheck the little checkbox and the support will go away and that's just it's amazing that that works but <laughs> yeah we got that kind of smooth and as you can see like all the time i'm just testing the coaster out to see if it makes it through the layout this is something i do a lot if you don't do this um, I'm sorry, but you might run into some issues sometimes with the coaster not making it all the way through the layout. I actually did that like a couple of weeks ago. I decided let's just try to make a little mine coaster and make it like go through mountains and whatever. And then all the way in the end, I, you know, realized that the most complex part of the coaster which was really complex. There were a lot of crossovers of the track and you couldn't really change anything about it. And I just, you know... <laughs> I uh, found out that it was too tall and the coaster wouldn't make it and I couldn't really make the lift any taller because it would just look out of shape and really weird. So you know I had to start over with that and I uh, essentially in the end I quit that project and I went on with building this. And <laughs> I think this turned out pretty well. Now what I was talking about in, this, in the beginning of this video, I built this in Rollercoaster Tycoon World and then in Planet Coaster and it was really bad. But you know some of you guys that uh, have seen that, it has around 24,000 views now. Um, and I must say, it, it looks, you know, it's, it's pretty bad for the amount of views that it got, you know. Um, so, I hope you guys like this one more, or even more, or whatever. You know, of course, the standards have gone up as well. The, uh, the game was still at a very early stage when I built Pantherophis the first time. And uh, the second time, I'm, I hope it's going to be <laughs> alright. And we can also now, of course, change the color scheme of the coasters. Uh, which I like a lot. So it won't be this blue color anymore. The name Pantherophis is actually from a family of uh, snakes that are kind of yellowish. It's called the corn snake, if I'm correct. And it's kind of um, a mix of yellow and orange and black and brown. So I'm going to try to use that, you know, make the track kind of brownish, uh, well, orangey brownish, and then the supports brown. But yeah, here we go. We are now recoloring the track, in fact, in the video. And. Um, yeah, I hope you guys like it. We're gonna add some more theming to it to make it look like it's actually part of a theme park instead of just a roller coaster somewhere out in the woods or on the plains. Uh, so we're gonna do some work on that, but that's gonna be done in uh, in some future time or some future episode. And that's gonna be basically there's gonna only be two videos of this. One with just you know being building the coaster that we are doing right now, and the second is actually going to be um, about making the scenery and then after that there's just gonna be one showcase video in which I just 
show the track and uh, yeah we'll see about uploading it to the, to the workshop or something like that you know it's gonna be pretty cool and right here you can actually see me take away some supports because there are way too many supports uh, basically every single little track piece that you make if you make it out of really small ones every single track piece will have a support under it so you will have to take away some of them to make it look slightly realistic and not over dimension so <laughs> I hope that worked out well um, and yeah what else can I say I hope you guys liked me uh, this video of me building this coaster and I hope to see you guys in the next video of this series now the next video I'm gonna upload is not gonna be about this it's gonna be about Park Miranda but still I want to thank you guys for watching so until the next video peace from pieces of prestige